of age, Kyoto remains the richest repository of Japanese culture. Since 794, Kyoto has been the stage of religious and political struggle. As for the actors of the traditional theater and the full gamut of Japanese artistic traditions. It would take a great many visits to fully cover the main attraction. The city encompasses over 2,000 shrines and temples. With its gold-leaved walls, Kinkakuji Temple reflects the power of the late 14th century shogunate. The majestic Kiyomizu Dera Temple has witnessed almost the entire lifetime of the ancient capital. Its buildings have been destroyed by fire, earthquake and warfare, and the current structures were completed in 1633. Surrounded by vast and verdant grounds, the former imperial palace preserves traces of an elegant lifestyle of bygone days. Today's artisans dress traditional dolls in clothing that would have made the ancient aristocrats proud. The painting of the doll's face is crucial. It brings the doll to life. The weaving of vividly colored kimono is another local specialty. has fostered the development of various cultural etiquettes, such as that of the tea ceremony. One of Japan's oldest and grandest festivals has taken place in Gion, Kyoto's entertainment district, since the year 869. Towering four-ton chariots are a centerpiece of the parade. The engineering skills required to turn these gargantuan vehicles are very much a part of the spectacle. At nightfall, another of the 250 festivals on Kyoto's calendar gets underway. Every year, Kyoto receives over 40 million guests, and with this year's celebration of the city's 1200th birthday, things are crazier than ever. Next morning, soothing tranquility returns. Nothing captures this tranquility or communicates it to the visitor better than the stone garden at Ryoanji Temple, whose seven stones formation has given rise to a myriad of interpretations. Kyoto, the cultural capital of Japan. <laughs> 